With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello, we are given with the question, and the question says an ideal gas is given which expands isothermally from volume V1 to V2 and is then compressed to original volume V1 adiabatically. Initial pressure is P1 and final pressure is P3. The total work done is W. Then which is the correct statement, right? So, let us say initially we have P1, V1, T1, right? In second stage, we have P2, V2, T2, right? And in third stage, P3, V3, T3, right? So, what is given is uh, we are expanding it isothermally from volume v1 to v2 so it is going isothermally from here to here right isothermally so in first process since is it is isothermal what we can say is p2 v2 to be equal to p1 v1 so we can write p1 v1 by v2 this is p1 Right? Since it is isothermally, so T2 would be equal to T1. Right? So this is the uh, condition. Right? Since V3 is equal to V1, we are going back to the same, uh, same state, right? V1. Right? And we are going adiabatically. Adiabatically. Right? So, what we can say is that P2 V2 power gamma would be equal to P3 V3 power gamma. Since V3 is equal to V1, right? So, we can write P, uh, P3 to be equal to P2 V2 power gamma by V1 power gamma, right? This is the second one, correct? So, now, uh, what we will do is we will substitute this equation in this, right? Therefore, P3 would be equal to P1, V1, V2 power gamma by V2, V1 power gamma, right? So, this would be equal to P1, V2 power gamma minus 1 by V1 power gamma minus 1, right? So, what we could say from here is that, uh, since we know that for this process, right, since we are uh, compressing it, right, so gamma is greater than 1, we know that, so gamma minus 1 would be greater than 0, right, if gamma minus 1 is greater than 0, that means V, that means V2 is greater than V1, since that is given already, right? So, V2 power gamma minus 1 by V1 power gamma minus 1 would be greater than 1, right? So, what we could say uh, from here is that this implies that P3 would be greater than P1. So, P3 should be greater than P1, right? So, when P3 is greater than P1, so we have to find out the work done also. So, work done is equal to in the first process, right? So, we can write W1. That would be equal to P1 V1 log V2 by V1, right? So, that would be equal to P1 V1 by gamma minus 1 into log of V2 by V1 power gamma minus 1. Right, so this would be less than uh, P1 V1 bracket V2 by V1 power gamma minus 1 minus 1 by gamma minus 1. Right, and in second process, the work done is equal to P2 V2 minus P3 V1 divided by gamma minus 1. This is adiabatic and this is isothermal process. So, this would be equal to P1 V1 
1 minus v2 by v1 from here we can take p1 v1 to be common when we substitute here p2 right so p3 is from here we will substitute and p2 from the above equation right so when we substitute we get p1 v1 into 1 minus v2 by v1 by the power gamma minus 1 by gamma minus 1 right so since this is given from here this could be written right so the net work done is less than zero right since we have this value see here v2 by v1 power gamma minus 1 is greater than 1 so this would obviously be negative right so that would be less than 0 right so when p3 is less than p1 the work done is less than 0 so work done is less than 0 when p3 is greater than p1 right that is option c right that is our answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today